They say in the morning as they were going to check the ark of God, they saw their God upon lying down facing the, the ark of God. And then they stood their God upon up. He said the next day when they were going to check the ark of God, he said that one was lying down. They said they found the dark one lying down with broken hands, hands and head. Hallelujah. I want to encourage you, say that the Lord that has served the Mzimu are not evil. He cannot be compared to any other God. He says, I do not share the glory with other gods. This is guys were testing God by putting their God next to the ark of God. And 
above everything. I would have to encourage you saying, we are going to worship God. We are going to praise the Lord who is and who was. Amen. 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 He said, This our God is above everything. He was there before the beginning began. Amen. This afternoon we are going to worship God. There is one thing that God has done for you. If we can ask you, you know that which you can go before the Lord and say, Lord, I praise you. If you feel like there's nothing that God has done for you, but you are going before the Lord and say, Lord, you are wonderful. You are saying, Lord, you are good. You are the God who does everything. And you will see God coming in your situation. We are talking about the God is above all things. He said all things were there because of him. You cannot lack words to tell your God. When we worship God, children of God, we are not going to ask for food. This is not the time. This is not the time saying, Lord, hear my prayer. This time, you are telling him who he is. He said, God can do all things. But he cannot worship himself. That's why if That's why when God says all living things you should worship God. Because God cannot worship himself. He wants you to worship him because he gave you the bread of life. Here is his worship, Lord's mind. Amen. Here is his soul, sing now, says worship. Saying, Lord, here is my worship, smile. Bring both to smile today with your worship. Call me to want to smile this afternoon. Tell him that he is holy here. Don't ask for wisdom while we are about to worship God. Do not ask God to fix your marriage. Tell him that Lord, you can do all things. And you will see God rescuing your marriage. I will humbly request all of us be on the Why we are about to worship God is above all things.